I'm Rob Gannett with Fire Pumps R Us. Today we're going to be demonstrating our new E400 Plus. This pump has been automated with controls that will automatically start them upon a pressure drop in the fire sprinkler system of a building. Uh, if you look, you can see we have uh, also uh, cut down the pumps so that they're only 32 inches wide. They're on wheels, so if they need to go into as small of a room as a 36 inch door, it's no problem. We can put them in there for security and hook into the building system just like the normal fire pumps are. Here you can see we're using a four inch inlet coming off of the city supply comes from over here. We've taken off a normal fitting that would be there, a 90 degree elbow, and we put in a T fitting so that we have a tap for our water supply for our fire pump. This is normally just the tank fill for this building. And then we have taken out the 90 that was here and put a T in also and put our own little connection point so that we can pump into the building's uh, sprinkler system. This is a standard setup that we do and uh, today we're going to just demonstrate exactly how this pump system works. Get ready to do a, uh, a 500 gallon uh, roof flow. Rob, we're gonna go ahead and uh, start the flow right now. We have to stand by. Get ready to open the valve and start the flow right now. Okay, we're closed off. Okay, that was a uh, successful uh, 500 GPM test. 